So if you need something in your shop, the test trader plugs, you know, we get a lot of stuff in and somebody will say, hey, the pickup's got an issue. We'll plug this in and we can diagnose real quick. So in my early stages, I put on a few hitch plugs. I put on a few flatbeds and send a customer down the road without the trader lights working. So I built my own tester because the little plug-in testers you buy from the auto parts stores, sometimes will give you false signal. So what I found is we took lights that came off of a cabin chassis. We have piles of these things. And these incandescent bulbs will actually draw enough current that it'll trigger the trailer control module to activate. So a couple things we're looking for that you cannot test with those simple plug-in testers are one, the battery charge. So the truck's not gonna charge the battery unless it detects a trailer. The voltage reference to these light bulbs will make the trailer control module detect a trailer, which will illuminate this light. This second light right here that is flashing, that is a voltage reference going to the trailer brake controller. So it's pulsating, looking for trailer brakes on the trailer. Essentially, it's shorting this light to ground. And when it shorts it to ground, it says, okay, I'm connected to trailer brakes. And so we can detect that the trailer brake controller is sending an active signal to what thinks it is a trader here. Even the reverse lights will work if we were to start the truck and throw it in reverse. But simple tools that would have just been thrown away in the shop, you can turn into something very handy.